Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Lumen Moon Tarot. So everybody I am here doing a random collective reading. This reading is for the collective and it is not going to resonate with all of you okay. So just take what does resonate, toss out the rest. Don't try to force it into your world okay. And thank you to everyone for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations everything that you guys do that helps this channel keep growing thank you so so much for all of it um okay so what i'm really feeling like here is somebody um i'm gonna read the cards a little differently i'm reading this tower moment a little bit different i feel like this is like a swell of emotion inside of you and just kind of a like an energetic outburst is really what I'm feeling like, like an energetic outburst from you, like um, that's it. I don't want to think about this lover situation anymore. I don't want to think about it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Like smashing the tower down yourself um, very, very quickly. Uh, you know, it's kind of like a sudden realization, but I think it's more like a sudden outburst from you. This is something that's been pent up and swelling up for a long time. And I feel like you've just reached the limit. That's really what I'm feeling like here. You've reached a limit for this lover's situation, this soulmate. Um, maybe it's even the twin flame stuff, okay? Um, because it's like, you know what, you're, you're making a judgment call on this, I feel, and it, you're just bringing it down. You're like, that's it, it's done, I don't want to look at it, I don't want to think about it, I don't even want to make any decisions, I just want to walk away. I mean, I, I kind of get the feeling like you're just ending this, especially with the world card here, it's the end to a cycle, and you're bringing it about, um, I just feel this swelling up of energy and just finally saying F it you know what I mean that's seriously the feeling that I'm getting off of you guys today um yeah yeah you're I feel like you know faith and this four of wands right this is a reunion card I feel like for the longest time you you had faith in this connection you had you had um, faith in the messages that you were getting about this connection but it's just to the point where it's 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 just become too much for too long you're just tired of it here is what I'm seeing you're tired of it I, I feel like um, you want some you want someone new you're focusing on a new two of cups a new soulmate connection here um, well, this is a wish fulfillment card but I'm seeing somebody here like all jolly with a lot of drinking okay somebody could be doing drinking out here uh, too much drinking sorry doing drinking I feel like you just want a new love you want your wish fulfillment. You want somebody who's going to fill your cups. You know, you want the real deal. Okay. And, you know, here, here you are in reverse. I just feel like you've, you've waited too long. You've worked too hard. Um, yeah. And justice. I just feel like you're, this is something that you're, this stuff up here, you're giving up on. Now you're allowing in, I feel like you're allowing in a new wish, okay? Um, you're just kind of like stamping your foot down here and saying, you know what, forget about this. I, this was a great connection. It was a beautiful connection, but I can't deal anymore. I feel like it's all the thinking about this and wondering whether or not you're, that this person's going to get their karma. Wondering whether or not this person's ever going to come in for this reunion. I feel like it's just, it's got you off focus. You could be um, a Libra, but I feel like you're just off out of focus here. You're, you should be focusing on yourself. You should be in the upright. 
but I feel like this just knocks you off of your game, you know. Um, it clutters your mind, and I feel like it holds you back from getting the things that you want. Um, I feel like you just need to maybe stop focusing on on if this person's going to get karma or not. That's one of the things you're cutting out. I, I just feel like you don't want to think about this at all anymore. You just you've got your blindfold up. You're like no no no. T you know tilting your head back like I don't want any part of it. You know. And I feel like you just don't want to think about it anymore either because it screws up your balance, um, especially waiting to see if they're going to get their karma. That's really what I'm feeling like, waiting to see if they're going to get their karma. But you have new love coming in, and I feel like you need to focus on all the new stuff coming in for you in the new cycle. Because this old cycle stuff is coming to an end. I feel like you're putting it to an end. You're just done. Meanwhile, here, there's somebody who's watching you. Uh, I feel like this is your person watching you like a hawk with absolutely no plan of how they're going to come back in and, and get into your good graces. I feel like they kind of see this as being over, too. <coughs> they're feeling very left out in the cold. I apologize, guys. I, I'm I'm getting a cold, so like I'm really like, Ugh, you know, and not feeling the greatest. But yeah. Anyway, um, this person has no idea how to how to get back inside your good graces, your your bubble, right? They have no idea how to do it. I feel like they left you out in the cold. Um, and now they're just watching you. They're kind of studying you. Feeling like a fool. Wanting to take a leap of faith towards you to have a new journey, I feel. But here's the thing, though. I mean... They keep creeping in. Yeah, they want to fly in and talk to you. Okay, you could be dealing with an Aries. You could be dealing with the Knight of Swords. But here's the thing. Uh, you're not really dealing with them at all. I feel like you've already cut this person out. I do. I feel like this is the person that you're like, I just can't deal with this anymore. And, and, and waiting and watching to see if they get if you get your justice if you get um, karmic justice whatever their karma is it's really just holding you back from new love there's a new love here that's wanting to come in um, thank you yeah this is like you know, a lot of times I see this as like the Ten of Cups. I just see this as an extremely powerful card. That's what it is to me. And it's like everything is kind of inter interconnected with the, the lessons that you've learned from the past, okay? Um, from this past situation. I really feel like you're supposed to take these lessons, everything that you've learned here, all the levels you've been on, okay? Um and start a new journey. You've got new coming in. And I feel like you guys kind of are like waiting to see if this person's, yeah. You're waiting to see if this person is gonna get their karmic justice, but they're showing me like, you know, it's like the pillar of salt thing. Don't look back, you know, manifest something new here. You could be a Virgo or dealing with a Virgo. You've got all the tools necessary, all the tools that you need to manifest something new. And you're strong because you've learned all the lessons. And you're standing in your strength, in your power, in your integrity, your truth. I mean, who would want to mess with this person? Look at that face, right? 
you know, it's kind of chilling. Ooh, nobody wants to really mess with you right now. Now is a good time to focus on new, you know. And I feel like that's kind of what you're doing here. You're, you're manifesting. I feel like you just, you had that, you... You've been carrying this energy around with you for so long, and it's just like you've just had enough. I just feel like an outburst here from you. That's it. I don't want to think about this. Yeah. You don't want to think about it anymore. You're done. You're done. Ten, this It's a completion to a cycle here. It's the end. And I feel like it's going to be the end of sleepless nights, nightmares, anything like that that's been bugging you about this. Yep, and you're moving forward. You're moving forward. Healing. This is a very healing card. You could be a cancer. Any water sign. I feel like you've, you've healed enough to be able to move forward now. You know? You're not in your emotions. I feel like you're thinking about things logically, making a choice, not making choices for you that are good for you and really bringing down towers things that things that really weren't built to last okay it needed to fall yeah so you're moving forward here i feel like somebody wants to come flying in to talk to you um, they're feeling like a fool they don't want to be out in the cold anymore they want to talk so you may hear from this person but I think you're just done with all of this kind of energy, to be honest with you. Uh, to tell you the truth, I really feel like these two cards here are the most important cards out of the whole entire spread. It shows me that you've healed and you've acquired really strong boundaries. And there's a strength about you moving forward. Um, you're not feeling that emotional pain anymore. You know what I'm saying? You can move forward in confidence and strength, taking charge and taking control of your own future here. Yeah. That's really what I'm seeing here for you. I do feel like your person will come in and try to communicate, but... I feel like you've got this determination about you now. You're just done with this crap. Um, yeah, you're releasing. I, I feel like you're releasing it and moving on. Just, just try to be mindful, you know. Try not to look back. Try not to look back to see if they're getting their karmic justice. Because in doing that, it holds you back, right? In the upright, you're growing. But in reverse, there's a problem. There's some kind of blockage, something slowing you down. And I feel like that's what it is. Focus on you and get this card back in the upright. Okay? And it'll just help you... Um, move on into your future a lot more powerfully okay does that make sense anyway everybody that's what i've got for this reading um very empowered i'm super proud of you guys i think you're on the right track um just pay attention to you focus on you right Anyway, I hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. If you like this video, please click that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Help me grow And if you like this vibe and it's resonating with you, right? And um, yeah, until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.